Hello guys, this is Deathfell. Welcome back to another episode on the Let's Build a Modern City series. This is episode number 8 and today we're not going to be doing any buildings in this episode. In fact, today what we're going to be doing... Yes, we still have a problem with the F5. Today we are going to be working on a highway. Now this highway is going to be running along here and it's going to be indented into the ground and it'll run from well, we, we don't exactly know yet, it'll probably be in one big circuit because this map we're playing on, well, we're going to have the city on it, of course, but I plan having other things eventually. So, yeah, this highway will take us to those other things in the future. So, basically, what we're going to need to do today is we're going to need to, well, extend these roads out and build the highway and connections to the highway because you can't just connect it to the highway directly you need a bridge and on ramps and off ramps so yeah that is going to be a bit strange for me to do because well yeah I haven't done anything like that before but yeah it should be fun also, this is um, our work from last episode, we only about one of these townhouses last episode and since then I've stacked them up and this is what they look like. They're all the same so it, I suppose it looks okay but when you have more things in the street like cars and other things it's, it'll look a bit better. And this time we're going to have like a little park with trees and stuff so yeah that should make this look a lot better. Anyway guys I've got to stop talking and get some work done and well cue the time lapse.
So guys, that is the build done with. This one's a little bit shorter today, but yeah, well, we got done what we wanted to do. So yeah, this highway we've built is pretty long, extends for some ways, as you can see. And of course, this is going to go all over the city, there's going to be more eventually. But we've got to take a look at the small little segment we've done some detailing in. So we've got some lampposts and then, well, I'm going to explain how this whole thing works. So, go to make it as if you were driving in the left. So we're going to use the, as we're doing with the rest of the city, British laws, so driving the left hand side of the road, things like that. And what we have here in Britain, on the roads, is we've got a hard shoulder on your left hand side and you're on motorways, so that if you your car decides to break down you can turn into the hard shoulder and stop and wait for the, um, I don't know what you call them, the emergency services or whatever. So yeah, and as you can see you've added little detailing blocks here like these carpets with gloss down below. This is so that if you were actually driving a car, now I'm currently learning to drive, and you drove into this part of the road, you'd actually feel the bumps in the road. This this is meant to tell you that you're in you're on the hard shoulder or on the other part of the road where you aren't actually meant to drive. So it gives you the incentive to get off. So that's why these are here and just to add some light. And also the same in the central reservation here. Because this is to tell you to get off this part and to tell you that you're a bit too close to that this wall and you may crash into it. So yeah, I have thought about this quite a bit, but if this road were to extend further up, and it will eventually, um, there's going to be a bridge here, and if we go further up, and if you remember the monorail we have that extends across and it's meant to be across an avenue, that avenue we've got to extend across over here and then there's going to be on and off ramps onto the highway. So yeah, that's that. Anyway guys, I'd like to thank you for watching this episode. As usual, if you like this episode, make sure to hit the like button. And if you really enjoyed it and want to see more, now, make sure to subscribe. Thank you for watching, and as always, I'll see you guys next time.